Thanks, uh, Professor Livermore. Um, it's going to be a double act of myself, Francesca Crow, and Suliette Youssef. So I've decided to kick things off. Um, and we're going to talk about our reflections and experience of the HDI UK um, Black Internship Programme. So um, my team and I at the University of Birmingham have been involved um, the, in the HDI UK Black Internship Programme for the past three years. And we've really enjoyed this experience and over time it's grown even better. The HCI UK Midlands team, um, including mainly Kevin Dunn, has been really supportive and has involved our team from the very beginning um, to helping interview candidates for the internship, to being involved in this sharing webinar where we're talking about health inequalities and diversity in health data science. I really enjoyed the opportunity to be involved with Juliet's learning and to see her understanding um, of health data science and epidemiology grow over the two months. And this was really a case um, with Suliet of the learner becoming the teacher. So when Suliet and I were going through some R script, which is not a strength of mine, um, she was able to help me understand it much better. What this internship also provided um, me and my team is to strengthen our connection with the HCI UK Midlands team and we've been more involved with other with events such as this and the weekly um, the monthly meetings um, with the team um, as well. In terms of some of the reflections um, for this internship from my point of view having early face-to-face -face contact with the um, with Sulia was really key into engaging and and proving this to be a success and we were fortunate enough to have the HCI UK Midlands Conference where Suliet came um, to Birmingham and she was able to meet some of the people who are in, in this webinar today and, and obviously meet me as, as one of the people who were going to be taking her through the internship. And it provided a really positive face-to-face -face experience for her. Now, I do confess that I'm a really big fan of face-to-face -face meetups and interactions, and I really wanted to bring this to the internship, um, especially this year. Um, and that was really reflected in the plan that we had made. But I did um, appreciate that having a degree of flexibility was really important. And I think having that flexibility of having a combination of face-to-face -face and at-home working with this internship really helped to make this internship a real success. Now, I know that Suliet's learned a lot about health data science and epidemiology in her time in the internship, and she's going to share that with you next. But it's also been learning for myself and my team. So we had to go through some of our teaching materials and resources that we had and one to one with Suliet. And so it's really helped me to identify some of the components within my teaching materials and resources that I could really improve upon that will help um, uh, you know, with success of following internships and also with my wider teaching. It really contributed to our team's sense of community. So some of my PhD students um, helped Sulia with some of her R script for the projects that she was working on as part of the internship. And that really contributed to a greater sense of community within our team. And I really hope that we can help support Suliet's career with what she has planned um, beyond the internship. Now onto my last slide. And I really want to, um, sort of take the time to reflect that I think that the HCI UK Black Internship Programme is off to a really good start. However, I do really want to acknowledge, and, and I might not be the most qualified person to talk about this, that there are still systemic barriers and biases that limit opportunities and experience of some people in the uh, Black people in the UK, including in the field of health data science. And despite progress that has been made, there's still need for greater awareness and action to address some of these structural inequalities that continue to disadvantage some black individuals and communities. Um, and Professor Livermore just mentioned um, Black History Month, which is running this month. And I think it's a great initiative. It's running at the University of Birmingham. Uh, it's also running at my children's school and also in the wider community. And it's really helped me um, as someone you might have guessed, not growing up in the UK, great um, gain of better awareness and understanding of the black community um, in the UK. And so while us as individuals can play a role in combating prejudice, addressing institutional and structural biases does remain a collective effort. And we need industry, policymakers, and academia, we can all play a role. 
And I know that the Black internship provides opportunities that help to improve equity. And my team at the University of Birmingham are trying to develop further support for our internships beyond the program. And um, thanks for listening. I'm now going to hand over to Suliet, who will take you through the rest of our presentation. Um, hi, my name is Suliat Yusuf, and um, I'll be talking about the opportunity. And I'm happy to, and it's been great to be given the opportunity to participate in this internship. And participating in the HR UK Black Internship Program was a transformative experience for me that enhanced my skills and also deepened my understanding of the health data research. Through regular interactions with the team and, also, and mentorship sections, I gained valuable insight into the intricacies of data collection, data analysis, and also data interpretation. Francesca guided me through a series of statistical analysis and also like some staffs in the University of Birmingham also helped me with some of my projects. I had the privilege of participating in a project that focused on exploring the association between type 1 diabetes and epilepsy using match score analysis. Francesca guided me through, she gave me the project and she guided me through with the project and I'm so happy I was able to work on that project. Next slide please. Uh, my experience at the HR UK Black Internship um, was incredibly enriching, providing me with numerous insights and invaluable learning experiences that have been pivotal in preparing me for a career in health data research. And one of the key insights I gained during the internship was the critical role of data quality and integrity in research. I also had the opportunity to work with real world healthcare data sets, and it became evident that the accuracy and reliability of the data are fundamental to drawing meaningful conclusions. Should, um, during the internship, I, um, the internship program was crucial in getting me ready for a career in health data research. It didn't just teach me practical data analysis skills, it also helped me understand how important and intricate healthcare data can be. Next, please. The internship provided me a unique opportunity to apply statistical modeling techniques to real healthcare data and working collaboratively on various research projects allowed me to significantly improve my data analysis skills in R. The Black Internship Program encouraged collaboration with interns from diverse academic backgrounds. We were given um, data to work on as part of Group 7. We were given um, the um, cancer data to work on, and we were asked to predict the vital status of the cancer, of which my, my team came third um, during the um, um, competition, and which was I was happy about. I was able to work with other internships from other organizations, which also like helped me grow and improve my communication skills. The collaborative nature of the program fostered an environment where interns could learn from each other's experiences and contribute to meaningful research projects in the field of health data analysis. The internship provided me, okay, yeah, so um, I went for the closing ceremony in London and there was an artist that was drawing this. I see this um, internship as a stepping stone into, um, as a stepping stone supporting uh, my supporting the pipeline and also like making me uh, make uh, choices on um, health data research because there are so many diverse, uh, there are so many um, opportunities in the field of health data research. So this internship has given me the opportunity to stepping stone for me to make a decision and also for my future on what I want to pursue later in life. And I am thankful for the opportunity to be able to participate in the internship. I saw how health data analysis has the potential to influence healthcare data policies, improve patient outcomes, and drive innovation in the medical field. This first-hand experience deepened my appreciation for the critical role of data in healthcare decision-making. One of the most valuable aspects of the internship was its exposure to diverse career paths within health data research. Through interactions with mentors and exposure to different research projects, I realized that this field offers a wide range of opportunities, of which I am thankful for. In conclusion, the HER UK Back Internship Program at the University of Birmingham has been a transformative experience for me that not only deepened my understanding of health data research, but also exposed me to various career paths within the field. And thank you so much. <laughs>